Okay, here we are on Google Sites, and what we're going to be doing here today is we're going to show you how to create a section in Google Sites and add videos to it. So this is useful for instances in which you want to share with your team different video opportunities that they can use in their class. It's also useful to be able to share with your students. I know my son came home today excited about a video that his teacher had shown him at school. So we're going to go ahead and actually use that video as our example today. So the first thing we're going to need to do with our Google Sites page we set up is we're going to need to create a new page. What that'll do is that'll give us links up here that we can click on for our people to go through. So I'm going to add a page here. In this case, we're going to say this is for math. So it's going to take me to that. This is how it'll look. Once that is set up, I'm going to go over here to insert and I am going to insert a layout here. In this case, I want to do multiple videos and descriptions. So I'm going to choose this option here that has three. I'm just going to drag this over to here. And what this is going to do is this is going to give me three options here where I can put different videos up. So that all three of these could be math videos. I'm going to click on the plus sign here and I'm going to tell it I want a link from YouTube. At this point in time, I'm going to go to the YouTube page for the video and I'm going to copy the URL there. In this case, it's a song about double doubles that my son came home singing. And we're just going to paste that link into there, tell it to search for it. Once it's there, just click on it and select. And there it is. We'll name all this the double doubles song. And then if I wanted to put additional text in there, I could. If you want to make sure the link works, you just go up here and there is a preview button. You can click on that. You'll be able to see exactly how they see it. Down here is a large screen tablet or phone, how they're going to see it in those. You can click, make sure the link works. It'll play there. You can make it large if you want, but that'll give you a chance to see how this is going to look to your students. So you can use this for videos you found online and videos you've created, and that'll give you one central place where you can keep videos for either your team or for your students or both, and they'll be able to go see what it is you've got for them. Until next time, I'm Kent Smith with your Technology Minute.